The Diet of Galicia building was built at the end of the 19th century by the Lviv architect Julius Hochberger. He was inspired by the regal facades of Vienna. In just four years, the building was completed, a veritable work of art right in the center of Lviv. Prominent craftsmen and sculptors carved the intricate ornamentation of the building's exterior. Not one sculpture in the facade of the building is accidental. The building is crowned with a sculpture called the Guardian Spirit of Galicia. Galicia is presented in the image of a woman. Alongside, there are allegorical representations of two rivers, Dniester and Vistula. Below, there are four figures, faith, justice, education, and labor. They embody the key virtues to be guided by. And on both sides below, there are sculptures that also symbolize education and labor. It was the period of the Industrial Revolution, after all. In the first half of the 20th century, the building became a university. Historical artifacts are carefully stored there. This is the hammer that laid the cornerstone for the Galician diet. A government delegation arrived from Vienna, and Albert Milt, a court locksmith, that was his title, a position approximately equal to the Minister of Construction. He presented the ceremonial tools with an appropriate engraving. The building's interior is no less impressive. Today, the former session hall of the Diet serves as an assembly hall for the Lviv University. The organization of the main hall of the Galician Diet was planned out very rationally. After all, the project was created simultaneously with such buildings as the parliaments in Budapest and Berlin. A special two-person commission had visited all the capitals of Europe to look at civil structures, from parliaments to schools and even laundries. They had to realize the best project possible. The hall can hold up to 300 people. Above, there are balconies where the press and citizens who wish to attend the diet meeting sat. The ceiling is made of glass. This room is called the Mirror Hall. A narrow circle of officials had meetings here. Now, the university staff gather here. The most valuable things here are two mirrors from the 19th century. They're covered with several layers of silver, and their sizes are very large. They're rare, even by modern standards. Mirrors, sculptures, and ancient molding. The unique architecture of this Lviv Sanctuary of Sciences amazes everyone who enters or even just passes by.